All right, you're watching Weather AM. It is Friday, November the 15th. It's time for your national forecast. And we will begin with some video here. And November can bring anything, right? It can bring snow and wind like it did in Iqaluit, and it should bring that. Uh, it can also bring, uh, in terms of the, the, the moose, the moose come out as well. There's the female and there's the male. They're a good looking couple, aren't they? Uh, this trail cam near Calgary for the thankful outdoorsman. I'm thankful for that video. Uh, in the morning hours, uh, we've been Port Stanley. Yeah, the sunrise, it's, it's late. The sunset is early. Oh, the days are getting short, are they not? And of course, we also know that uh, in the uh, in the words of Axel Rose, uh, November rain. Yeah, you get a lot of that in St. John's. About 40 millimeters of rain yesterday, and we've seen more rain. So the RCMP have been uh, letting people know that you know um, just slow down we could have some ponding and pooling out on roadways the rainfall warning is now over in st john's and the avalon the precipitation is moving east to west so this is a retrograding low and with the warm air overriding the colder surface we've had freezing rain in through new brunswick that's changing over to rain showers east to west as the temperatures warm up you've already seen that warm up in pei parts of nova scotia so a very warm day this is a subtropical feed after all and that war that uh, unsettled weather into labrador happy valley goose bay uh you already got the freezing rain and that's going to spread so churchill valley to postville could be looking at several hours of freezing rain right through tonight and uh, from further north and west locally 15 plus centimeters of snow so pretty active on the east coast the winds gradually diminishing today and tomorrow but another storm system looms for uh, sunday into monday and even into early next week so i guess if you're in st john's this is what that all means a lot of damp skies not a lot of sunshine periods of rain and temperatures well above seasonal it is carrying moisture from the subtropics after all Let's get to Quebec. Eight degrees in Montreal. Beautiful day today up towards uh, the Laurentians and down through the eastern townships. Ottawa six, nine in Toronto today up through cottage country with the gradually clearing skies after some cloudy skies yesterday and heading to the Taylor Swift concert this evening for those. And if you're not heading there, maybe you want to avoid downtown because of course it gets a lot of people down there. Seven degrees will be this evening forecast and through the weekend, sunshine and mild on Saturday, Sunday, a little more cloud cover still above seasonal no snow squalls no big travel headaches expected uh, we've had some light snow in northern manitoba place around the flynn flan and thompson and up towards churchill the pot could see a bit of a mix 10 degrees in winnipeg today tomorrow you're going to stay warm enough for rain showers in winnipeg but further west dauphin brandon the parklands and into southeastern saskatchewan saturday we're expecting periods of snow that'll ease through the day on sunday and we'll also turn our attention towards the foothills we got a little more snow snow in your forecast too but two to five centimeters of snow locally five to ten over higher ground in southwestern areas of manitoba through saturday so travelers watch out for that it's the next storm is in the pacific so today is the calm before the storm gray cup revelers enjoy today vancouver is such a beautiful city when the weather is decent as well but then we've got the rain coming in and tomorrow it may be cool enough in the malahat and even simon fraser university we might see some flurries before that changes over to rain and spreads its way eastwards.